Welcome to Electro Online. In this example, we'll have one more wrinkle, one more additional thing we need to worry about. Notice we have a minus 3x here, and so maybe we're going to have to divide by a negative number and flip the inequality signs. In addition to that, we have to worry about the absolute value signs. First of all, we realize that we have the absolute value of something less than or equal to 7, which is like case number 1, and so we know that we can write it as follows negative 7 will be less than or equal to the quantity inside the absolute value signs minus 3x plus 5 which is less than or equal to positive 7 and now we need to solve that the way we know how the first thing we want to do is subtract 5 from all three sections of that inequality to get rid of the plus 5 in the middle so that ends up being minus 7 leave some space here minus 3x plus 5 leave some space less than or equal to 7. And then we realize that if we subtract a 5 from the middle, which of course we also must do over here and must do over here, we can get rid of that plus 5 in the middle. So on the left side we end up with minus 12, less than or equal to minus 3x, these cancel out, less than or equal to a positive 2. Next we need to divide by negative 3. But since I have to flip the inequality signs, I'm going to repeat that. Minus 12, minus 3x, a positive 2. We're going to divide each by a negative 3. And since I'm dividing every portion of that inequality by a negative number, I have to flip the inequality signs around. So this becomes greater than or equal to, greater than or equal to, instead of less than or equal to. And now we can continue. On the left side, we end up with a positive 4, greater than or equal to a positive x, greater than or equal to a negative 2 thirds. And that would then be the solution to our problem. Graphically, it will look as follows. Here's 0, here's 4, here's negative 2 thirds. Notice it does include the values x equals 4 and x equals negative 2 thirds, so we'll put a solid circle there. And notice x is smaller than 4, which is the left of 4, and x is greater than negative 2, 2 thirds, which is the right. So it's actually the region in between those two values. And so that is then the solution to our inequality. The, the absolute value of minus 3x plus 5 is less than or equal to 7. And that is how it's done.